Welcome back at 619. She went from farm worker to teacher to lawyer to judge. In fact, she made history by being the first Latina to serve on the Texas Court of Appeals. Here's Rick Diaz with today's Con Mi Gente. They came to celebrate with her. She is retired now, but this is her day. Judge Linda Yance. I'm, I'm excited and I'm just moved by all my friends and family who are here to share this with me today. And this is why they're here to unveil her portrait that will forever hang on the walls of the court. The Court of Appeals is on the fifth floor of this building, but so many people showed up they had to move it down to the first floor. Judges, friends, family, standing room only. 24 years ago, Justice Giannis was appointed by the governor to serve as a justice of this court. And and it was her work with the poor and migrants that caught the attention of Governor Ann Richards. I was very much aware that we never had a Latina Court of Appeals judge in the history of this huge state with so many Latinos, right? I went to school in a segregated system, so we had a huge dropout rate. Among her many accomplishments, she fought the state of Texas before the Supreme Court on a law that kept undocumented children from attending school, and she won. And the children that uh, she represented in name uh, on this U.S. Supreme Court case lived with us, they stayed with us. I couldn't be more proud, I couldn't have a better role model, uh, and to have her as your mom is, is incredible. Her two daughters are also lawyers, and her granddaughter might be following those footsteps. I think she's an amazing person and that she's an inspiration to me. Uh, I enjoyed serving with you from 2003 to 2010. I want to thank you for your mentorship. We used to pick cotton in the, you know, the cotton fields there in Cameron County. They'd pick us up before dawn. We wouldn't come back till dusk. There were no regulations. We didn't have bathrooms. We didn't have water. Life now is grandma, and I also sit as a trial judge. Life is good. Um, here I am, and I'm still going, and there's still, you know, there, there's still some fuel in the engine, and I'm still going. Judge Linda Youngs, she made history. For Channel 5 News, I'm Rick Diaz. Call me